I, Professor Charu Sharma, Assistant Professor at GNIT Institute of Management Studies, Greater Noida. Firstly, I would like to congratulate Dr. Arun Dave for organizing such a prestigious international conference on the theme of Viksit Bharat. I am truly honored to serve as a session chair to this esteemed conference and to have an opportunity to review the research papers including the title Assessment of Omni-Channel Retailing Characteristics and Its Effect on Consumer Bank Intention. So, uh, the very first paper which I am reviewing is named as Assessment of Omni-Channel Retailing Characteristics and Its Effect on Consumer Bank Intentions. The author for this research paper is Dr. Viren Chavra, who is a corresponding author, and co-author one Dr. Bhavesh and Urvi Zalawedia, Assistant Professor, Faculty of Management, Manag University. When, as a reviewer, I review their paper, first thing which I recommend is to be that like, citation would be for the AP that has to be in a APA style. Second thing which I found in the result sections or I would say in the data uh, analysis part, there is a mention of 0.637 is a significant value. So I recommend it to be reviewed as it is not a significant value. So they has to uh, re-evaluate this results as well. Second thing, uh, as a conceptual framework, as per my suggestion would be the conceptual framework has to be restructured. Proper table number has to be mentioned. When we talking about the methods or we are saying about the data collections, they have to refer some of the uh, citations has to be there. When they are developing the hypothesis, so I believe uh, like when they were uh, giving this hypothesis, they have to give the literature review for that, like uh, how they drive this hypothesis as well. So this is my uh, third uh, submission, like as a reviewer, I'm suggesting that has to be, uh, hypothesis part has to be re-examined as well. When we're talking about the future and limitations and future study, I found that they have mentioned that this research is done in only Ahmedabad region of the Gujarat. Further study can be done in other regions of Gujarat that will provide broader view with respect to omni-channel buying intentions. Yes, so I believe like there has to be mentioned uh, the limitations more by the at the researcher perspective or I would say the third person uh, representative as well. Uh, and that as already mentioned referencing part has to be like, aligned with the APA style as well. So being a reviewer when I'm reviewing a research paper which has a title exploring the attitude of working women towards e-wallet transaction. Uh, very first I would say my suggestion has, has to be there has to proper mention of the author's name. So that is definitely missing the author name, designation and address. So this is the one thing which I recommend it has to be uh, reviewed. Second thing, if I'm talking about the abstract part, uh, or I would say, yeah, that is the abstract part I would say that has to be re-examined. Uh, or I would say the restructures when they are introducing the introductions, right? So it has to be properly cited by I in a APA style. It is uh, missing in this, I would say. When we're talking about the literature review, uh, again, the APA style is missing in this. And additionally, uh, I would recommend, you know, that APA style has to be in a fashion or in a tabular form. Like they have only cited uh, four papers, I would say, or they are just considering 2017, 18, 19, 21, 22. So I think there has to be a wide range. Uh, they can be included. So it has to be like a 10 year of literature review as I found it that would be more uh, generous. Thank you so much and I am uh, accepting, uh, like my suggestion would be, we are accepting this paper for the further uh, revisions, after revisions, we can definitely uh, give them a call for it and all the very best. Thank you.